today I have the most amazing cardio workout for you. By the time you are done, you are going to feel like you are on drugs. Not even exaggerating, but first shout out to my premium members. Thank you for making my world so much more beautiful. I love you. I appreciate you. We have a good thing going, me and you. Let's jump straight into the workout. We're starting our warm up today with side reaches. Nice and slow and steady, nothing too crazy reach your arms out one at a time your goal here is to get your arm parallel to the floor as you do that pop one leg out it's like this like that like this baby da -da 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 -da. there you go that looks beautiful next up we have some macarena hops put your hands on your waist i make like beyonce they don't even know You don't have to jump. If you're unable to jump, just step your feet. That works too. That was good. Next up, we have a swing and squat. We're gonna build up the intensity here. You're going to do a very wide squat. Make sure your toes are pointed out and you're just swinging your arms. Get your whole body ready to move. Our last warm up move here is trunk twist. Very similar to the side reaches we did in the beginning, except now you're placing more emphasis on twisting your waist. Really reach your arm backward, get your midsection ready to work. It's going to be good. That was beautiful. We're jumping straight into the deep end with cross jacks. You're going to jump your feet so that your, your feet cross at your ankles. Your arms are parallel to the floor the whole time. You've got 30 seconds. Do your best. Let's go. That looks good. Cross your feet at your ankles. Cross your arms at your wrists. Keep your arms parallel to the floor. That looks good. Suck your abs in. I love it. Keep going. You can do it. You are doing amazing. Look at that. One move down and almost done with the workout. Keep going. Cross at the ankles, cross at the wrists. Cross at the ankles, cross at the wrists. Suck your abs in. You look good. I love that. That was perfect. Next up, we have static runners. Essentially, you are running without actually moving. And we're going to do one leg at a time. This will challenge you, but it's highly effective. Are you ready? You can do it. You definitely can. You're going to keep a slight bend in that knee that's on the floor. Good, that's good. You can hold on to something if you need to. That's all right. Just keep raising that knee as if you're trying to run. Keep your core engaged. This is so good. Switch your legs. We're going to do the same thing on the other side. One side is going to be more difficult than the other. Totally normal. That's just proof that you are human. Keep pulling your knee up, back. Really step that leg as far back as you can. Get a nice long range of motion. That was so good. So beautiful. Our next move here is reverse X taps. You're going to jump your feet out and step your foot back. Jump it out, step your foot back. Keep a slight bend in your knee the whole time and keep your arms in the active position. Let's go. You are doing so well. You're almost at the break. Yes, you are doing it right. Jump your feet out, jump them in, step back. Alternate your feet. That looks good. Keep your core engaged beautiful you lean forward just a little bit before you step your foot back these are the dynamics that allows your body to stay mobile moving sexy hot healthy beautiful bonita oh my goodness you're killing it next up we have butt kicks your goal here is to pull your heel as close to your booty as you can i know i know but you got this run for the hills mama sita let's go you're doing good. That looks good. Your range of motion is good. Keep your arms in that active position. Make sure your core is engaged. Pull that heel back. Beautiful. There you go. Keep going. Keep going. You can do it. You are doing well. You have one more move and you get a break. Focus on that. Don't worry about anything. You have one job. Kick your booty. And time. Last move of the day. We have speed squats. The purpose of these squats is to get your heart rate up. You're not going all the way down and you are aiming for speed. 
That's why they're called speed squats. Are you ready? Let's go. Don't think too hard about it. Just move. There you go. I love that. Oh, I love what you're doing. Keep your toes pointed out. Scoot your booty back as if you're sitting on something and go down. Do your best. Keep your feet flat on the floor the whole time. Your toes are going to want to point upward. Control them toes. Control them. See? See? I told you. It's hard, but you're doing it. After this, you get a break. Five seconds, four seconds, three seconds. Wow, you're doing amazing. Yes! Hi, I'm Cola, just like Coca-Cola. And while you're catching your breath, I just wanted to quickly mention that life is so much easier on my website. You get early access to all my YouTube videos. You get exclusive educational videos that are not available on YouTube or anywhere else. You get premium 30-minute workouts. You get all of my love. I got carried away there. You can grow your booty with my eight-week booty program. You can lose your belly fat with my 21-day belly fat focus program. You can be consistent with your workout routine by using my 30-day challenge, and you can reach all your wildest health and fitness goals with my 12 month full year workout schedule all of this is available to you to try for free on kabokofitness.com so go ahead check it out i think you'll be glad you did welcome back next up we have possibly the most hilarious but awesome cardio exercise ever it's called penguins just do as i do we're gonna start off with your legs once you get the leg movement down then you add in your arms once you get that, add in your arms. That looks awesome. You're just shifting your weight from one foot to the other. Pump your arms down, up. Pump them down. Keep your abs engaged. You're doing good. That's awesome. This goes by so fast. So fast. If you could do penguins, you can do the next one. We're doing up and outs. This time you're doing butt kicks, but you're adding in your arms. You're raising your arms up and down, up and down, up and down, and then you hinge at your elbows. It sounds more complicated than it actually is. Let's move. There you go. Copy my arms. That looks good. Suck your abs in. Beautiful. You're doing awesome. Keep raising your legs. Up, down, up, down. Make sure you're getting the full range of motion. All right, flap. This takes talent, I'm telling you. Up, down, up, down, up, down. It goes by so fast. Next up, we have the side hop punch. You're going to do a gentle hop in place. Your feet should be nice and wide, and you're punching from side to side. Are you ready? Let's go, you're almost done. After this, you have two more exercises and this workout is complete. You would have burned a crazy amount of fat. Punch, punch, put some energy into it. Perfect, there you go. Make sure your arm stays parallel to the floor. Your fist should be clenched. Beautiful, that's good, that's good. Done. Give me some jump ropes. Pretend you have a jump rope or a skipping rope in your hand. And just gently, you know, hop in place, all ladylike. Your feet should be as close together as you can manage. Abs tucked in. And let's go. 30 seconds. That's all we have to do. You can do it. Those 30 seconds are going to pass. Make sure they pass while you're doing something awesome for yourself. Keep that soft bend in your knee. You look good. Suck your abs in. Beautiful. There you go. Now just maintain that. Get your rhythm. Look at you go. Keep going, keep going, keep going. You were Beyonce just a few minutes ago. So you can finish. Finish strong. Almost there and time. Oh, when I tell you I am proud. Our last move of the day is ski jumps. If you're unable to jump, you can do the modification on the right. They are both highly effective. Pick what fits your fitness level and do your best. If you are jumping, keep a slight bend in your knee when you take off, when you land, and remember to shift your weight to your heel when you land. Keep your core engaged. If you are stepping, step as far to each side as you can. This is your last move. You're doing awesome. Almost done. 
You are almost done. Keep going. And yes, you did that. You worked out today. Bam. Let's cool down. We're just going to do a simple toe hold. Take your time with this. There's no rush. Really feel that stretch in your calves, your hamstrings, the back of your thigh. You moved so much today. Unbelievable. Listen, those, those butt kicks, wow. When you're ready, just slowly roll up. Very slowly, stack one vertebrae at a time. Your head should be hanging low and heavy. Your arms should be hanging low and heavy. When you get to the top, roll your shoulders. Feel the weight of your head. Finally, I want you to put a slight bend in your knee. Give yourself a big hug. I just want to remind you today that you have energy and power beyond your wildest dreams inside of you. So keep showing up. Keep doing your best. Keep having faith. And remember, I love you. Thank you so much for working out with me today. Subscribe to my YouTube channel if you haven't done so already. And I'll see you in my next workout video.